Welcome back to our podcast. Welcome back. This is our ASMR channel. <laughs> Anyways, uh, we decided to do a different video for this video. <laughs> yeah. Uh, a little different, but a little the same. Shocker. What do you think? What do you say? I say we're so unpredictable. We're very unpredictable. Who knows where we'll be next? Uh, anyways, we decided to come on a walk, and we were like, well, we can talk about... Um, our attempt at healthy living. Our attempt at healthy living and while well, we walk. So we're just going to kind of talk about what we feel, what we think, uh, some, I don't know, just thoughts. We'll talk about politics, how the world is ending, how you can't trust your governor, and your landlord's lying to you. Yeah, no, we're not going to talk about that. Anyways, um, we hope you guys enjoy this walk with us. So, yeah, stay tuned until the end so you get some... You'll get a special prize of our faces in so, an end screen. So you get some uh, knowledge out of this video. Yeah. Anyways, just... Uh, we're gonna just record some of the surroundings and just talk and walk. We probably will do more talking than walking. Yeah, or more walking than talking. So it's a mystery. <laughs> All right. Hey, sorry, that was probably loud to you guys. I made bread. Didn't make it was bread. really good, and that's why we have to walk because I make bread. <laughs> yeah. Yo yo yo. Okay, guys. So. You're probably going to hear a little bit of wind. It's fine. We have our little microphones <laughs> to try to be better. Also, we're vlogging out in public, and so it's kind of like embarrassing a... because there's cars going by, and he's, yeah. like, holding this huge tripod out. It's not huge. It's, just... it's very it's obvious visible. we're videoing ourselves. Yeah. Um, so, what we want to talk about was how we mm -hmm. attempt to live healthy. And I don't think we're not, like, gym rats huge like health nerds we love sweets we love bread we love pizza we love food okay yeah. but it's all to be enjoyed in moderation and so i feel like he's kind of going along the lines of what i do like we've kind of like he's kind of merged yeah, into definitely. my theology for healthy eating definitely. now i would say that a majority of the time we try to at least have like a green smoothie or some green leafy vegetables. Oh, those smoothies. Listen, <laughs> they don't have to be bad. Like, they taste really good. She's made some really, really, really good smoothies. Oh, by the way, that's my sister over there. Over I'm there. Hiding. Ah! <laughs> um, she has made <laughs> some really good smoothies. I'll um, put the, the recipes yeah. in the description. You should try it, definitely. They taste amazing and they're very healthy and honestly it just makes you feel better it makes you feel like yeah alive it actually really increased our mood to eat good food for yeah. us and not so bad and so we try to do that we try not to eat fried chicken that much like fried yeah. meats <laughs> um sticking with chicken and turkey i cook a lot of turkey for us um any like noodles we eat i um eat with sorry any noodles that like i cook or make with i normally do whole wheat 100 percent whole wheat noodles or veggie noodles like cauliflower noodles soybean noodles stuff like that um and i don't even tell him and he says it's good most of the time yeah, it's always good like i don't know everything she's been cooking it's she's been telling me that it's healthy that it's not that bad and <laughs> i've enjoyed it like it's honestly yeah. really good so Definitely, that's something that you, you. So don't don't eat stuff that you don't like. Yeah, I find say, things that you like, and just make your own meal. You know. Yeah, I say like we really enjoy pasta, so I take a hundred percent whole wheat noodles, and I use um, no sugar added sauce. Oops. If you look at stuff like sauces and um, pe peanut, whoa, peanut butter and uh butter and stuff like that get unsweetened there was someone running and our video got interrupted so enjoy this photo we took get unsweetened um and no sugar added because a lot of places add sugar for no reason and yeah. read your labels that actually <laughs> takes so much away um which is really good 
So that's basically what we try to do food wise. Eat leafy green veggies and yeah. pay attention to what we like what's Definitely. in our food. Definitely. And when I when I bake I use like um unbleached flour. So it's not like as bad and as processed. So So, so to the next point, um, we sat down on the swing for this. Yeah, it's just more comfortable, at least for now. Uh, it's mainly moving our body. It's something really, really important if you want to have a healthy life, and it's something we we have talked about. Sorry, you hear a lot of wind. Um, we have talked about this, and is you don't have to do workouts that are just too intense on you. Mm -hmm. Like you can do things that you enjoy that don't kill you and that also will help you lose weight or just stay healthy um you know we, we talked yeah. about that the other day i can um i'm gonna put in the description the link for cayenne's channel and her video that um we watched on um being healthy and what she did was she wrote a list of like like movements she enjoyed doing that moved her body and were good for her so yeah. Hers was like surfing, swimming, stuff like that. And um, mine, what I felt to put, like I've been recently doing yoga, not in the spiritual sense. I've been doing like just physical yoga. Yeah. Um, we come and walk. Um, this are like we we're getting back into jogging more because both of us used to yeah, run. These so. are like our favorite. This is like our yeah. favorite movement. Like just walking, it's it feels really good. You feel the air, feel the wind, uh, fresh air. You get vitamin D. Uh, and it just feels great. You can walk slow. You can walk at a fast pace or you can jog, like she mm -hmm. said. Uh, so that's definitely. One of the things I put on there was like jumping jacks. So do things you love. I like, don't enjoy those. I hate planks. I hate push-ups. I'm, like I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. And it's just going to make me like dread working out. Versus if I do something I actually enjoy that actually fuels so much of, like, spiritual, mental, physical, all yeah. the things, then I'm actually going to really want to do it. Um, so that's that's one of the things is choose something you want to do and you'll be more likely to stick with it. Yeah. Um, and I think above all of this is definitely to have a relationship with the Holy Spirit because you can't have self-control without Him. You can't have patience without Him. Um, you can't have grace without him for yourself uh, because you don't go to a beach body in one day or a week. Yeah, just just, ju just go for something that you actually enjoy. Like, that's mm -hmm. what I've been doing. I normally do 10 push-ups every day or I try to do it. Uh, I haven't done planks in a while, but I enjoy doing those. But I don't really enjoy doing jumping jacks because they just hurt my back and hurt my feet. And mm -hmm. it's just it's too much for me. So definitely uh, don't don't go with the uh, what everybody does and like you have to go to the gym i mean you, you can but even in the gym uh, at the gym you can choose your own workout like that's something that i i, I started doing when we were going to the gym at, uh in reading that's something I, I was doing i was just choosing my own workouts i was not really going with videos or like the typical stuff we did yeah. things that looked fun for us and worked for us because he had back pain and yeah. feet pain and um so we did things that we wanted to target that we enjoyed not a specific workout but we were like we're moving our bodies and we're having fun yeah. um and it was it was very beneficial honestly but the next thing is um drink water yeah. you cannot work out without drinking water. Most of the days you can't get out of bed without drinking water if you're dehydrated because you're exhausted because you're just not fueled. <laughs> and you, water's important. I mean, it's, we're it's... gonna leave that there. You need to drink at least, at least half your body weight in ounces of water a day. Yeah. And so we got him a water bottle. Um, he forgot it. Yeah. So this is, like I said, our attempt to be we're, healthy. We're working on it. Like yeah. I've been recently doing, I was doing, better than i'm doing right now with water like i was doing better like two weeks ago 
I was carrying my water bottle everywhere. Now I forgot today, and I had it ready, but I forgot it. So those are little things that honestly you see the difference. Like I see the difference in my face. I see the difference in just in my body and how I feel. So those are like like we said, those are little things, but at the end they add up a lot, like to your health. And we're not only doing this to just look good or to just lose a lot of weight. We're doing it because we want to feel healthy. We want to just take care of our bodies, you know. So, And we yeah. want you guys to be inspired because we definitely do not have beach bodies, neither of us. I think both of us would say that we, yeah. we do not have Pinterest bodies or Instagram bodies at all. We have functioning, beautiful, godly made bodies yeah very much we're married body <laughs> <laughs> first year of marriage body yeah first year of marriage body, body after the wedding um and so we want to encourage you guys that like we're on this journey with you guys <laughs> so it's awesome. not like Lacey's laughing at us no she left at the thing that oh at the guy that just yeah there was like a scooter really fast. but we want to encourage you guys that even if you want to lose 100 pounds or even if you feel like you can't take a mile walk start slow and move your body every day yeah. just put in the effort put your phone down for 10 minutes and just move if you do jumping jacks twirls twists whatever yeah. you want to do move it and you'll start Definitely to see not. you'll start to see yeah that's something that uh, one of my friends told me one time he's like take a little walk around the block start with that take a five minute walk start with that and then start working up start working your way up so don't start with lifting 100 pounds or don't start with running two miles like start with the mile slow walk something obtainable something obtainable something that you would enjoy as well this is supposed to be fun and supposed to be enjoyable it's for you and your body i've yawned like 10 <laughs> times in this video. um but yeah that, that, those are some of the things that we want to talk about now we're just gonna keep walking. We're gonna finish our walk, and we're we'll gonna, get back to you at some point. Yeah, we're gonna take some clips of the of this place. It's a beautiful place. We honestly love this place. So <laughs> again, ah, but yeah. beautiful man and we wanted to finish our video um just to sum it up eat leafy green vegetables drink your water and move your body and you'll slowly start to see changes and as you do you'll slowly gain more energy and then you'll want to do more and then you'll be able to run or you'll be able to do more things and you'll want to eat more veggies and stuff like that um and just one thing that I like to say is 80% bad, 20% 80 good food, 20% bad like, food. like, hold on, that's not it. <laughs> so realistically, we probably eat 80% bad and 20% good. No, I think... Yeah. Well, I think we it eat depends. pretty good. We like, eat pretty good, yeah. And, and, and here's the thing, like, what I want to add to this is, like, don't overdo it in my opinion i think it's better to just enjoy life i think it's better to enjoy life than just being super strict with yourself so but like we like we said like find limits that are healthy and that you enjoy as well like don't only be like i'm never gonna eat pizza again because that's just torture you're gonna yourself. go to a kid's birthday party and you're gonna eat pizza so just Set, set yourself some reachable goals that are also enjoyable for yourself. Mm -hmm. uh, 
for me, I want to lose weight. I'm in the process of losing weight. It's taking a minute, but I'm taking it at least a pound a week. If I can't, it's okay because I have stuff. I have life is just not that simple. Sometimes life just gets hard. And but I mean, if you want to go all the way, if you want to be super crazy with it, that's fine. Like that's you. But if, and if you enjoy it, that's okay. But if you don't enjoy it, find healthy limits. You know. Yeah, I would say like I overdid it and I tore muscles in my legs and would like almost pass out and stuff like that. So definitely find a way that you love that's not overdoing it. Yeah. And one way, if you're trying to lose weight, one way I love to do is actually see how your clothes fit. Realistically, like this is a large shirt. Most of my short shirts are larges because I'm really tall, <laughs> honestly. Yeah. Um, and mediums are just at my belly button. Yeah. But um, like how your shirt fits, does it fit really tight up here? Does it fit really tight at the bottom? Where would you like to target your pants? Do your pants button? See, like that's something that uh, sometimes I used to measure like that, but I still used to like look not that great. But yeah, I got to a point where my pants were not fitting. My shirts mm -hmm. were not fitting. And right now, most of them are fitting again. Um, also, something I would say, don't make the mistake that to go like to the other extreme. Because I did that uh, back when I was in Honduras and also in Reading. I just went to chill and I started eating, enjoying. And it's like, oh, those are the 15 college pounds. <laughs> yeah. So... <laughs> We definitely, definitely got the 15 college pounds. Basically, yeah. So definitely just stay in the middle. Don't go all the way to the extreme where you kill yourself and you work out like extremely hard. And also don't be lazy and stay all day in your couch sleeping. Because I used to not do that. That's an extreme. But I, I used to not move my body that much. Uh, and now I'm honestly really enjoying what I'm doing. I'm just walking. Uh, being healthy, doing some workouts, and I don't over push myself. In, even though I know I can and I have the ability to do it, I just try to stay in the middle. So yeah. So yeah. that's basically everything for today. We hope that you guys are encouraged. And if you want to know more of like specifics of like, like I can give you guys a video on like recipes I cook during a week. Um, if you guys want more of that. Basically for our physical health, we just do like little YouTube workouts and walk yeah. around. Um, sometimes we jog. And then um, when it comes to water, yeah, just get a good water bottle that you like and you're willing to carry around all <laughs> yeah, the time. Yeah. And she, fits in your car, cup holder. Yes. She got me a, she got me a really pretty water bottle. We may show I'll it later. It. Yeah. I'll link it in the bottom. And like those are colors that are meant a lot for me and now I just love carrying it around. So. Yeah, and it fits in the cup holder. That's such a big deal. Like, I had a water bottle that didn't fit in the cup Huge. holder, and he hated it because it, would it kill flew someone. ever. It would kill someone. Like, I would like, you know, we all swim on breaks, and I would swim on breaks, and it would like fly, and I'm like, this is gonna bust my windshield. We have to get a different, <laughs> yeah. different water bottle. So, um, yeah, but that's everything for today. Uh, we hope you were inspired by this. We hope you decide to get up and move. I'll put some of my favorite yoga videos down in the bottom. Um, and the cayenne video, we'll put a bunch of stuff down there for you guys. Yep. But we hope you enjoy. We hope you enjoyed Move this your body. beautiful park. It's like a walking trail. So, we filmed here so many times. Yeah, it's pretty. So we took some clips of the place. Uh, there was something on my uh, So you guys can, can kind of see where we come to walk. It's, it's really pretty. Oops, my mic was down, sorry. Uh, yeah, we, we we took some clips, and we just hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like it, subscribe, comment, share it. Just don't forget to watch our previous video, by the way. Mm -hmm. If you haven't watched that one, go check it out because it was really funny. Did you say? Yeah. Did you think? It was really funny. I had Oops, to think sorry. about what our previous video was, but <laughs> it was really this is, funny. This is a drawing challenge. Um, yeah. If you want to laugh, go watch that. If you want some peace, go watch our video on peace. If you want some joy, go watch our video on joy. <laughs> if you want... We have, we have some... If you want some relationship advice, go watch our relationship advice. Yeah. And comment what else you need so we can produce please, it for you. Please comment what you need. 
and why you want it to watch. <laughs> we can get you what you need. I'm just kidding. Yeah. We can't. We can pray for it. <laughs> okay, guys. Um, we're going to keep walking. And see you next time. Ka-chao.